This basic electricity training covers the concept of power, how electric power is calculated, and the relationship electric power has to voltage, current, and resistance. When discussing electricity, it is important to have an understanding of electric power. Electric power is the rate at which work is performed, or the rate at which energy is used over a period of time. Work is often expressed in joules. In electrical terms, one joule of work is accomplished when a voltage of one volt causes one coulomb of electrons to pass through a circuit. When this amount of work is accomplished in one second, it is equal to one watt. A watt is a standard unit of power. One watt is also defined as the amount of work that is accomplished when a voltage of one volt causes one ampere of current to pass through a circuit. This relationship between power, voltage, and current is expressed by the formula power equals volts times amperes or P equals E times I. In terms of other Ohm's law components, the formula for power can be represented in two additional ways. P equals I squared R, or P equals E squared over R, where power equals P equals watts equals volt amperes, I equals amperes, R equals ohms, and E equals volts. A great deal of our electrical equipment is rated in watts. The rating gives you an idea of how fast the electrical equipment converts electrical energy into things like heat and light. Consider a 50 watt household bulb and a 100 watt household bulb. If both bulbs are rated for 120 volts, like most household bulbs, Ohm's law can be used to calculate the resistance of the bulb and then the current flowing through the bulb. The calculations show us that the 100 watt bulb has less resistance and, therefore, more current flow. This shows that the 100 watt bulb converts electric energy faster, performs more work, gives off more light and heat, and uses more energy. For your electric company to determine how much to charge each customer each month, they simply read from the meter the amount of power that was consumed over that period of time. Since electricity is consumed at a rather high rate, it is impractical to calculate in terms of watts. You probably are familiar with the terms kilowatt and kilowatt hour from looking at an electric bill. A kilowatt, abbreviated KW, is equal to 1,000 watts. A kilowatt hour, abbreviated KWH, is equivalent to 1,000 watts power draw for one hour. Charges for electricity used in your home are calculated by multiplying the kilowatt hours used by the rate per kilowatt hour charged by your electric utility, which is typically somewhere between 10 and 20 cents per kilowatt hour. 